Here is what the Alexander Stefan, the author, says about neurophysics, stem cell physics, genomic physics, and public health. Genomics and genomic medical physics have advanced rapidly over the last decade. The research field is shifting from testing rare genetic disorders to the diagnosis of diseases, heart disease, diabetes, stroke, osteoporosis, cancer, and others. The medical physics is now in a position to prevent a disease from occurring, in other words, to treat the cause rather than the symptoms, as it has been mostly the case up to the present days. A significant role, it seems to me, is played by the involvement of theoretical physics in medical research. It is the revolutionary onset for medical science, the paradigm shift in medicine, and public health. The development of genomic medical physics is empowered by the information acquired from the United States Human Genome Project. It is possible to design the treatments and drugs to each individual patient. The risk of getting a disease, or even infections, is almost always in part due to the combination of genes a human was born with. By using the genetic information, medical doctors predict, with different degrees of certainty, what diseases their patients are at risk of developing. Consequently, medical doctors use this information to reduce the chance of the disease from occurring or to prevent it completely. The explorations into the nature of human genome, one of the major scientific challenges of the 21st century, sheds light on how faulty genes play a role in the cause of a disease. Commercial efforts are shifting away from diagnostics and toward developing a new generation of therapeutics based on genes. The drug designs, pharmacogenomics, are being revolutionized. Researchers worldwide are now creating new classes of drugs based on the information on gene sequence and protein structure function, rather than the traditional trial and error method. Drugs that are laser guided to specific sites in the body and the brain promise to have fewer side effects than many of the drugs used currently. The ultra-short laser guided drug delivery techniques have a high potential in targeting drugs to specific molecular areas in the brain.